Hi, Don Campbell here with Expand to Web. And a question I get a lot is, how do I have multiple domains with my Bluehost account? How can I set up multiple websites with multiple, multiple domains on one account? So I want to show you how to do that. When you sign up with Bluehost, you have a primary domain that's associated with your account, and the files for that domain are in the public HTML directory. Okay, but what you can do, and what a lot of people don't know, is that you can go in and you can assign new domains. So you can register new domains either at Bluehost or elsewhere, and then assign them to your Bluehost cPanel account, and then put those files in a different directory, so that then that domain maps directly to that new directory, okay, or folder, whatever you want to call it. So how do you do that? Well, what you want to do is go into your cPanel for Bluehost, and I'm assuming that you've already registered your domain or pointed it to Bluehost with DNS, okay, so that you have the domain available. What you need to do then is go in to the domain manager. And from here, you're going to go in and you're going to select the domain that you want to map and you need to assign it to your account. So when you assign a domain to your cPanel account, what it does is it actually allows you to point that to a different subdirectory on your account and it gives you the ability to make it look like an entirely different website. That's what's called an add-on domain. So you choose the domain from the dropdown and then you select this radio button called Add-on Domain. Once you click the Add Domain button, you'll get a message saying that the pro it's being processed and it might take a few minutes, up to 15 minutes. Now usually it happens within just a couple of minutes, but they kind of have to give themselves a window. So what it's doing now is it's mapping that domain name to that subdirectory on your system. Okay, and once that's done, you can go back in your cPanel you can go to Simple Scripts and install WordPress and just point it at that domain and it'll automatically be installed in a new location. So in Simple Scripts, I'm going to select WordPress, I'm going to scroll down and install it. And from here, you just select the domain name that you want it to show up on and it'll automatically put it in the right place. It even shows you right there what directory it's going to put it in and this will act like a completely independent website. So now you can have multiple domains associated with your Bluehost account.